Honest. Jay Nowak. Oh yeah. A pleasure to meet all at last, and welcome back to Honest Jay Nowak. And so for today, this episode is in fact going to be one of a kind. Not just with the fact that, well, I got a new long sleeve shirt. This is probably one of the only times you might ever have a long sleeve shirt because I've not worn one in such a long time. I mean long. So anyways, this is a very long time coming for me. But other than that, HGN topics are going to be super abundant and very common for me to look for. So you won't really have to worry about me running out of ideas to talk about. But anyways, today's topic is just going to be me going ahead and talking about supplements. Because there's really a lot to say in the case of supplements. Especially with the fact that, well, health is in fact an important prospect on life itself. And I mean very important. And there are lots of things out there that I could potentially talk about, including vaccinations and the preparation of medicines and the usages of cures for various ailments of all sorts. But let's just say that not every single disease ever known to humanity can ever be cured. Especially if it weren't for the kind of science that we delve into on a daily basis. I especially have high hopes for the fact that, well, 200 years from now we could possibly be looking into very simple cures that will in fact eliminate the one and only, well, AIDS for example. But there are in fact a handful of other diseases that are somewhat conceived as uncurable but that's clearly just a myth. All it takes is some research, and it will in fact take many, 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 many years. So many years, in fact, I mean, we could probably all be dead by then. But the future does have a lot of hopes for us, and probably a lot of trust, that we are going to have to exercise as soon as possible. But in the case of supplements, I mean, there's tons of them. There's all sorts of vitamins and mineral type supplements that are all contained in specific capsules. No matter the size or quantity of each of them, you can be sure that you're getting the exact dosage you need. Me in particular, I do in fact happen to carry around large batches of different vitamins around. Especially A, C, D, Iron, Calcium, B12, E, and many others here and there. So you can expect me to really haul around dozens of different pills in many ways. And although I am in fact using a diet that does in fact allow for all these vitamins to remain within my system at all costs, the supplements of course are going to be there for me just in case if I end up skimping out on something. Like if I don't consume enough fish or if I don't have enough green vegetables to use then I could probably use any of the supplements that I need just so I can get my contents up in perfect condition. So supplements in a way, depending on your preference, I mean, there's lots of different choices. If you go to any pharmacy out there, such as CVS or Walgreens, then you might be able to see what you might want to get. But in any case, I will say that, well, there's certainly a lot to expect within the realms of today's health and public system. So anyways, that's pretty much all I got to talk about based on supplements. But if you want to see more, go down to my channel. Make sure that you like, subscribe, comment, follow me on social media, and stay on the Hollywood side.